Brexit panic has set in for the EU with ministers on the continent piling the pressure on Michel Barnier to agree a deal to allow fishing fleets to access British waters. With the transition period set to end in just over one month, the issue of fisheries remains one of the key areas of divergence which has so far blocked a deal. EU fleets rely heavily on British waters and, despite the UK now being an independent nation, fishing fleets have demanded continued access to the rich waters around Britain. Mr Barnier briefed MEPs on Friday following the conclusion of the week's talks and was later warned he must agree a deal or fleets could suffer. Flemish Fisheries Minister, Hilde Krevitz, insisted the negotiator must follow his mandate to maintain current access to UK waters for European fleets. She said, the fisheries sector in Flanders is a small but important sector. It is very important that access to British waters is maintained in the future and that the current quota system is also maintained. Under the Common Fisheries Policy, CFP, EU fleets are given access to waters across the bloc's economic zone. Due to the large and rich waters, British fishermen have warned the policy has allowed EU fleets to exploit the UK. In a bid to break the deadlock, the EU negotiator did offer the UK a return of 15 to 18 percent in fishing quotas. UK officials, however, rejected the proposal as it would allow EU fleets to maintain up to 80% of their current fishing stocks. Mr Barnier travelled to London over the weekend in order to resume talks as the two sides head into the final month of negotiations.